So let me just describe a regular worker situation. If she's not happy with her deal from her boss, what are her options? Can she readily go get another job? Well, no. For the most part, that's not available. Are the other jobs going to be quality jobs? No. Our job quality has actually been eroding. Can she readily go to her peers and form uh, a collective bargaining unit and be able to negotiate? No, that's not as available as it used to. If she's been discriminated against uh, by her pay relative to other workers' pay, can she go to court and get a remedy? The answer is no. She's probably signed a forced arbitration agreement that doesn't allow her to do that. Is the government labor standards, the minimum wage, and other protections high enough to allow her to support her family? The answer is no. So we have systematically undercut the ability of people to do for themselves. We have to reestablish a policy regime that is supportive of wages, and it's not going to happen overnight, but it has to happen in a way that you fully announce to the American people that we can do it and get, tell the narrative about how that can happen. Thank you very much. Thank you for testifying. Thank you.